It was the late summer of 1888 in London. Women were being murdered. The police and media called the unknown killer Jack the Ripper as terror set in. Many believed then and still do now that black magic was involved. The practice of occultism has a long and complex history within different cultures and societies. It is often characterized by its use of mysterious and sometimes supernatural practices and beliefs, which are usually seen as being in opposition to the beliefs and practices of mainstream religions. One of the most famous examples of a crime that has been linked to occultism, is the infamous Jack the Ripper murders, which occurred in London in 1888. In this video, we will explore how occultism and black magic have been connected to Jack the Ripper and discuss some of the theories that have been put forward to explain these connections. Jack the Ripper was the nickname given to an unidentified serial killer who was active in the largely impoverished Whitechapel district of London, England in the late 1800s. The killer was called Jack the Ripper because of the way he mutilated the bodies of his victims, who were all women, and because of the way he signed some of his letters to the police and the media. The Ripper's crimes took place between August and November 1888, and during this time, he is believed to have killed at least five women. All of the victims were killed in the same manner, with their throats being cut and their bodies then being mutilated. The killer was never caught, and the case remains one of the most famous unsolved mysteries in criminal history. Despite numerous investigations and a number of suspects, the identity of Jack the Ripper has never been conclusively established. Regardless of who the killer was, is it possible black magic was involved? To many, it appeared as though the crime scenes appeared to be the remnants of ritual sacrifices. The dismemberment of the bodies and the way the organs were laid out appeared to be a blood sacrifice conforming to some ritualistic formula. The Order of the Golden Dawn was a secret society that was founded in London in 1888, and was closely associated with occultism. It was founded by a group of individuals who were interested in exploring and researching the occult, spiritualism, and related subjects. The Order was known for its initiation ceremonies, which often involved elaborate rituals, as well as its use of magical symbolism and instruction in various forms of divination. Some researchers have suggested that Jack the Ripper may have been a member of the Order, or that he had some knowledge of its teachings. Is it a coincidence that the Order was founded in the same year as the Ripper murders in 1888? The Order of the Golden Dawn believed in tapping into the power of the Kabbalah, an ancient mystical tradition. They sought to use this knowledge for spiritual growth and advancement by studying its symbols, rituals, and teachings. The members of this order were devoted to unlocking secrets from within their own souls as well as from the universe itself through meditative practices such as astral projection and ritual magic. Ultimately, they wished to gain insight into hidden realms beyond our physical world so that they could better understand themselves and life's mysteries while also helping others on their journey towards enlightenment. But not everyone saw all of these doctrines as benevolent. There were those who interpreted the beliefs in a sinister way. Alistair Crowley was an English occultist and ceremonial magician, who is widely considered to be one of the most influential figures in modern occultism. Crowley was heavily involved with the Order of the Golden Dawn and its teachings, as well as exploring other forms of ceremonial magic. He was also known for his interest in black magic, which is a form of witchcraft, that is practiced with the intention of bringing harm to another person or entity. There have been various theories put forward suggesting that Jack the Ripper may have been influenced by Alistair Crowley or his teachings, or that he may have even been Crowley himself. Alistair Crowley founded a spiritual philosophy called Thelema which he believed to be revealed by an entity named Ibis. The core principle of Thelema is expressed through its primary axiom, do what thou wilt shall be the whole of the law. This statement encapsulates his idea that human will should guide life decisions rather than traditional morality or religion-based systems. 
His belief in this law has been seen as controversial by many people due to its apparent encouragement of self-interest over altruism. This moral attitude is pointed to when Crowley's involvement in the Ripper murders is considered. Blood sacrifice is a ritual practice that has been used in various cultures throughout history to honor gods or spirits or to bring about desired outcomes. It typically involves sacrificing an animal or human life in order to gain favor with the gods or spirits. In occult circles, it is believed that blood sacrifice can be used to gain power over another person or entity. There have been various theories put forward suggesting that Jack the Ripper may have engaged in blood sacrifice as part of his ritual practices. There have been numerous books, movies, and TV shows that have explored the connection between Jack the Ripper and black magic or the occult. The Ripper, a novel is by David L. Goleman. This novel follows the story of a modern-day detective who is investigating the Jack the Ripper murders and discovers that they may have been motivated by a belief in black magic. From Hell is by Alan Moore, this graphic novel explores the theory that Jack the Ripper was a member of the Order of the Golden Dawn and used his knowledge of the occult to commit his crimes. The novel was later adapted into a movie starring Johnny Depp. The Ripper is a TV miniseries. It aired on the BBC in 2020 and explored the theory that Jack the Ripper was motivated by a belief in the concept of blood sacrifice and used his knowledge of the occult to carry out his crimes. Ripper Street was a TV series from the BBC which aired from 2012 to 2016, follows the story of a group of detectives who are investigating the Jack the Ripper murders and uncovering clues that suggest a connection to the world of the occult. In this video, we have explored how occultism and black magic have been connected to Jack the Ripper and discussed some of the theories that have been put forward to explain these connections. We looked at how the Order of the Golden Dawn may have had some influence on him, as well as Alistair Crowley's involvement with black magic and his possible connection to Jack the Ripper. We also discussed blood sacrifice and how it has been connected to Jack the Ripper. While there is no definitive answer as to whether Jack the Ripper did indeed engage in occult practices or black magic, it is clear that these theories cannot be completely discounted either.